Now, Miss McKenzie, we will find out what we've done to that fine Lieutenant J.G. as soon as we get... There he is! See, we have our own kind of fatigues on this here show. I'm used to this. Are you? <laughs> well, I'll tell you what we have for you on the $200 clock. It involves uh, a canteen. You have a place where you relax, don't you, on the base where you are? Where on the say? base. Yeah. yeah, well, we have one here on this base. Both of you come over here with me. I'll show you what kind of a canteen we have. Bring out our relaxing canteen, if you will, please. There we are. Isn't that lovely? You can really relax in this one, too. If you'll step up there, Wendy's going to give you a shower cap to put on, and then you can lie right down, Lieutenant. Hey, that looks good on you. I like that. Lie right down there, if you will, with your head on that pillow and your feet out here. And, Miss McKenzie, if you'll step over there and step up on that ladder. That's the idea. No, not all the way on the top. Just up a couple of steps. Go ahead up. One, maybe two steps. You may want to go three. If you want to later, you can. That's up to you. Now. Have here a little Coke bottle. Nothing refreshes like a Coke, you know, the pause that. I want you to take this in your left hand, if you will, and hold it on your forehead. Because it's empty now, but your wife is going to fill it for you. What with? Well, there we have a canteen, too, you see. And all you have to do is to pour the milk that's in there into the, car the bottle. And as soon as it's reasonably well filled, we'll stop the clock, and you'll beat the clock. Will you take that for you? Now, we're going to make it real easy for you. We have something to help you pour this with, and here it is. Boy, look at that. Isn't that something? Look at that. Now, what you do is to hold that uh, by this. Hold it right about down here. Pour it in the funnel. You'll find it comes out like a little fountain, and you can sort of guide it right over there. If you want to go up another step, you may. That's entirely up to you. You want to? Is that better? Huh? You like it better down. All right, take a look at the clock. See how many seconds you have. You have 45 seconds from the time I say go. Are you ready? Go. Ready now? Yes. All you gotta oh. do is just press right in. Aim it right at with that Sylvania flash bulb with the blue dot for sure shot. No, it's it, not. Well, then turn it. Turn it. We've that's been it. Turning it. Turn it to the next one there. That's the idea. Keep turning here. You. That's it. That's the next Three one. There. Now there. try that. Go ahead. Now try that. See if that works. Flash away. No, it still isn't cocked. I'm sorry. The camera, we got a broken camera. Get a fresh camera because we want okay. you to have one of these Argus 75s. Maybe we can get a picture of it some other time. Thank you very much. You come on over here. You stay there. The girls will get you all cleaned up. All right, Miss McKenzie, come over here, if you will, please. And if you'll step up on this little platform right back here and turn around and face the audience, you will now have in back of you our jackpot board. On it are all of the famous words of a saying or quotation that are well known, and all you've got to do is get them back in order in 20 seconds so that they spell out the saying or quotation we're after. Do you understand? Okay, now don't look till I tell you to. Open the curtain. Turn around and take a look. Go. Oh, golly, I'm sorry. It's the old quotation, you may fire when ready, Gridley. You may fire when ready, Gridley, part of our country's history. Come on back down here, but you did awfully well because you got through our $200 clock. Let's see what you've won. It's America's smartest refrigerator. It's a beautiful eight cubic foot international harvester. The only refrigerator you can decorate or leave gleaming white. Either way, there's more room for more food in your International Harvester refrigerator. Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. McKenzie. You have just won a Beat the Clock prize worth more than $200. Our congratulations to you, too, Mrs. McKenzie. You'll find the back backstage safe and sound. Good night. <laughs>